What is up guys and welcome to another Red Dead Online money making video. Today we are in a completely different location. This is where we are at right now in between Van Horn and also Annersburg. There are no butchers around here but we have got a way around that anyway. But this is still a good location to go and make money. Right here we are able to do a, a, a lot, I was going to say a bit, but we are able to do a lot of fishing in this location. Now as I've been here, quite a few fish have despawned but as you can see we have quite a few big fish and quite a few small fish as well but because it took me quite a while to set this video up, quite a few fish have despawned but they will be dotted round all the way around this location. You can see for quite some distance. This can be a location where you go and make money or you can go and make XP as always with fishing methods you can do either one for me I'm always going to be going for money because XP I can no longer chuck dynamite in but this is actually a good location because what you can do is go all the way down to Van Horn go and get some dynamite come back to this location chuck a stick of dynamite in where there is a lot of fish and you'll be able to go and get yourself a lot of XP if you haven't done that if you if you have done that we 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 need to join together because I don't know any other way to make some quick and good XP but like I said if you haven't done that you can easily go and do this and as you can see I've done it so unfortunately I can't do that one but if you haven't done it definitely go and do that because you can get yourself a decent amount but for me I'm gonna be going and do a bit of fishing as always what you want to do is find a group and there's just a little group there and you want to chuck it far out probably not that far but just further than the group and then reel it straight through the group there you'll easily be able to go and get yourself a fish now I'm hoping we do not go and get this big fish I'm just want that like a little fish just which is right there hopefully we can get this one you're not gonna you're gonna go there we go so that's all you have to do and it does not take too long to go and get a fish a good thing about this location as well normally where I go you can just do a bit of fishing but because we are right close to the edge of the map what you'll have is a lot of birds fly over and at any point you can go and get rid of your fishing rod and shoot them down now right now I can't actually see any but you will have them come over so just keep your eye out and then eventually you can go and kill some birds. Also along here on this sort of sandy beach area you can go and get yourself quite a few rabbits. Now uh, earlier I once you first come, uh, once I first came here there was quite a few rabbits and I managed to go and kill them uh, and here they are just here but you go and kill them uh, as soon as you come over here. You probably won't get any more whilst you're standing here fishing, uh, but as soon as you walk over here or ride over here on your horse, you will be able to go and see yourself. Uh, quite a few rabbits, you might be able to get some deers as well, so definitely keep an eye out for them. But when I'm here, I wanna do as much fishing as possible. I'll try and get as many little fish as I can. Normally, you can go and get perch, rock bass, pickerel, and also bluegill, but then you can also get these big fish as well, which is very good because they are very close to the shore, which means you don't even have to go and throw your fishing line out to go and get them. All you have to do is just shoot them like that. And uh, I think I actually shot that one twice, so uh, that's going to be in poor condition. But a northern pike. If you can get that as good or perfect quality, it goes for $8. Now for me, I should have one already on the back of my horse, so I'm not too bothered about that. You can go and bring a second horse to this location. The only problem with that is that you have to travel all the way back down to St. Denis to go and sell stuff at the butchers, which is there. And that takes quite a while. So what I end up doing is I just go up to this fast travel point get off my horse and then fast travel all the way down to St. Denis and then go and sell my stuff at the butchers, fast travel back and then we go back to this location and you just keep on going back and forth. If you cannot get that many fish in this location, normally you will always find northern pikes at this location but if you want some smaller fish and they're not spawning in, you go all the way over to here. Here is another great place to go and get smaller fish. You don't really get too many big fish, but here is still a good place to go and get smaller fish. You stock up on them, come all the way back to this uh, this fast travel point, and then fast travel all the way back down to St. Denis, sell them there, and then fast travel all the way back up again. And that is the route that you want to keep on doing to go and make yourself some money. But anyway, guys, that is the method that I'm currently using in Red Dead Online. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. But for now, I'm going. So see ya.